Welcome to part 10 of Darksiders, and we are about to head off to the new area. We got us a new ability, and we're not going to use it. We're going to kill Yay. everyone like normal. Yay! Is there a reason we're not using it? Eh, I'm going to use it for special occasions, like bigger enemies. <clears throat> or a crowd of enemies. So it's like unleashed mode and, and as the werehog kinda. Pretty much. Oh my god. One of my friends just sent me a video and said, look, it's you. I will send it to the Discord right now. I swear if it's the actual werehog. No, it's not. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be cosmic timing there. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> Scoutish fold munchkin. Yep, it's a cat. A kitty cat. Speaking of cats, my cat just decided to curl up on my lap. So there's the cosmic timing right there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yes, this this uh, episode will feature guest commentator Riley. That's no, don't do not impersonate my cat. <laughs> oh, this video is adorable. <laughs> yes, my friend said it's. My friend said it was me. You can superimpose like, it if you want, Sunset. <laughs> yeah. She she literally tagged me and said, "It you." Yeah, let's, let's watch this real quick. <laughs> <laughs> violence, violence, death, and killing. Remember, violence is not the answer. It's the it question. is the question. The answer. The, the answer, answer is, is yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds like something War would unironically say. Yeah. Uh, I kind of want him or his voice actor to be one of those guys you pay on the internet to do random voice acting stuff. Oh yeah, and like that. cameo or something. Yeah. Like yeah. how Hugh Neutron's voice actor <laughs> does it for free. <laughs> yeah. Looks like you're going to the Shadow Realm, Jimbo. Oh, Liam O'Brien doesn't have a cam doesn't have cameo. Damn it! Uh. Violence is never the answer. It is the question, and the answer is yes. Well, I suppose if I meet him in a con, I could pay him to say that. <laughs> True. No, have him fight with himself as War and Infinite and Zaz. In Sanctus. Oh I forgot. <laughs> well, his his war and like his Sanctus voice is just kind of war as an old man. <laughs> uh, and his infinite voice is just war, but with a bit more gravel on it. Holy shit! You're right. <laughs> I did not think about that <laughs> until just now. Yeah, like I've been listening. I'm a voice actor. I know this stuff. We talked about uh, we talked about how War looks like a World of Warcraft character previously. Yeah. And it's funny because Liam O'Brien voices Illidan Stormrage in World of yes, Warcraft. Yes, I did know that. <laughs> and I think that's just straight up his War voice. <laughs> I, I haven't heard Illidan in a long time, so I can't say for certain. I'm more familiar with his Warcraft Three voice because I didn't play a lot of. A lot of WoW, just the, just a lot of wow. screwing around in Warcraft Three. Wow, you made the right choice not playing WoW. <laughs> <laughs> I just love cutting enemies' off, legs off. Yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, you're doing it all the time. Yeah. Chaos Eater is such a ridiculous name, I love it. I'm trying to remember what the other weapons for the other horsemen are called. Also, excuse uh, you, you don't eat Chaos, you drink him. He's <laughs> water. Indeed. Remember Chaos Cola from Adventure yeah. 2? <laughs> well, do you remember the time Chaos was made of pure ice in Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games? No, oh, I, I think not remember not. that. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, 
This is just the team's weapons. Fuck. Or no, that that's not how I spell horseman. <laughs> All right. So, uh, some scythe that we have is harvester. Strife's guns are mercy and redemption, and Fury's whip is called scorn. Badass. These all sound like names I'd come up with. <laughs> no, actually, genuinely, I think in a story that I was writing but eventually scrapped, one of my characters had pairs of twin guns named, um... Oh god, what were they? It was like... Uh... It, <sighs> it was like Amen and DL. Which combined met were supposed to be like a mena deal, which is the word of God. Hmm. It's been it's been a couple years since I last wrote that before I scrapped it, so I was trying to remember. <clears throat> Actually, do I still have the? No, I don't have the transcripts anymore. Story to mine. Nah, I mean it wasn't very good. I was proud of it, but it wasn't very good. It was always made for animation anyway. So trying to, like, actually write it as a novel was not working. I can't write worth jack shit. Well, I can, but the problem is after a... After what? You cut out there. And I get some... I said after a while, I just lose interest in my writing project. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. so do I. Yeah. Same here. And then I get too many projects on top, and then it just falls under everything, and it just becomes not important. See, that's how you know you're a writer. <laughs> <laughs> no writer actually finishes their story. Stephen King doesn't exist. <laughs> Any published author you've ah. seen does not exist for practical purposes. George R.R. R. Martin, who is he? <laughs> Well, no, George R.R. Martin is a writer because he Stein. doesn't finish. <laughs> you said they don't exist, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. Who the fuck is R.L. Stein? Like Never heard of him. The only fucking author I know. The audiobook that I had checked out recently ran out and I couldn't finish it. Which is a shame, too, because I like that book. I just never got around to finishing it, like, listening to it. Hmm. I still need to listen to my copy of, um, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy that I got a while back. I only watched the movie for that. It was pretty cool. So yeah, if anyone wants to send me a, <laughs> a copy of Anna Dressed in Blood by Ken Dare Blake, my P.O. box is... No, I'm kidding. My 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 PO box is one two three playground stret. Playground. <laughs> if, if anyone box happens is one, to one catch nine, that, eat my ass. If anyone happens to catch that reference, they will be forever in my good graces. Because and that is every comment is like they pretend they know what you're talking about. No, they have they have to have proof. They have to know exactly what video I'm talking about because it is a YouTube video. Hell, you know. I or know they could. Didn't Google they it. Could guess the, uh, up yeah, true. They could. But if you do, I will know. Don't ask how. I will. I, I'll just know. I'll know you cheated, so don't cheat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like those teachers that always say, "If you cheated, I'll know," and they don't. <laughs> When Revolver Ross so left, says no. I managed to fuck through all my assignments with barely any idea of what I was doing, and you gave me an A. And the art links is online. Yeah. Get away. <laughs> Hello, art links. Go away. <laughs> Don't even think of uh, using no. auto fire, or I'll know. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Metal Gear reference. Yeah. yeah. MGS3? It's. MGS1 and Twin Snakes. 
Okay. Specifically the Twin Snakes version of the one. <laughs> so one. Yeah. Now I'm trying to find the picture of what I was referencing. Yeah, because GameCube had that, like, turbo mode button feature on some controllers. Yeah. Gotta go fast. You can I also do that on PS1, I stop think. controllers. Hmm? Uh, the turbo button, I think that was, like, GameStop controllers. Yeah, I think so. Though I can't remember seeing any actual footage of of him seeing through the auto fire on PS1. Only GameCube. Only GameCube. Just yeah. GameCube. Like the meter just keeps going down and you die. I have not eaten today. <laughs> that is a bit of an issue. Why not? Uh -oh. What? I need okay, so before this. I no, because I didn't have time. Well, okay, no, I totally did, but I thought we'd be ready a lot sooner than we were, but... So I was just kind of waiting. So, should this be the last part we do, then, so you have time to eat before your rehearsal? Uh... I mean, I would appreciate that. Alright. I'm sorry to have to, like, cut it short, because we've only gotten two parts done, so... Yeah. Well, we're actually on the second part. Yeah. But who's ready to go back to the Shadow Realm? Yeah. Me. Don't Send worry, me there, Maximilian Pegasus. Back <laughs> Open your mind! Sunset, this this screenshot you sent was exactly what I was referencing about the I'll know. <laughs> <laughs> that is exactly what I was saying. You can tell when people are bad at BSing their paper. <laughs> You kneel before my throne unaware that it was born of lies. Me during most of my summer reading assignments. The best thing <laughs> ever. <laughs> Ooh, sudden use of caps lock there on the mission objective. Find the shadows and kill them all! <laughs> no. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I'm eating gummy bears. <laughs> They're just stuck in my teeth right now, War. Y you wanna <laughs> help me out? <laughs> Boy, help, I accidentally swallowed a gummy bear hole. Oh, look, it's another another arena challenge. <laughs> what do we oh, gotta do God. this time? I don't know. Counter killer. <laughs> Counter kill. Oh, yay! K -k -k Counter Breaker! Royal Guard! <laughs> yeah, basically. So, guess what I'm not good at? <laughs> Counter Breaker? Oh, Royal Guard. Yes, it's it is Royal, Royal Guard. Guard. <laughs> I don't counter or do this ever. I'm not a defensive player. So, this stuff fucking sucks for me. Oh, you're gonna have fun with Zigbar and Kingdom Hearts then. <laughs> yeah. Cause that's that's his uh, whole fight. Don't tell me that. Zaldin too. <laughs> oh, Zaldin, I'd argue, is worse. Oh, I'm God. still. Speaking of Zaldin, I'm doing a I'm doing a proud mode run on my PS3 copy of of 2.5. Currently stuck at Zaldin and Beast's Castle. <laughs> That one had me stuck for a while until I realized I could just press the square button and then mash triangle because the jump command breaks him in half. Yeah. <laughs> what keeps killing me though is like his spammy teleport move he does towards the end of his health bar. And he like comes up to you and sometimes attacks, sometimes just yells, Sora! Yeah, right. Because I don't what? have many Where? of my. Because I, I don't have many of my drive forms leveled. <laughs> On that file. Yeah, I made sure I made sure to grind drive states as soon as I could. Like as soon as I found the optimal grind spots, I grinded drive states. Yeah, like I, I think I, I have loss I was worried about. Yeah, my first run of KR my first run of KH2 was a proud mode run. Because I thought I, I actually played Dream Drop Distance first. That was my first Kingdom Hearts game. Hmm. And I thought standard mode was too easy. <laughs> So I was like, yeah, sure, I'll play proud mode. 
and I actually had a pretty breezy time through it. Ever made. Oh god. There's an argument to be made that in Kingdom Hearts 2, Proud might actually be harder than Critical. Hmm. It's because you get the... You take more damage from enemies, but unlike Critical, you don't get those exclusive buffs at the very beginning. Alright, what's this? You do have a point, but I think about Johnny's level 1 critical mode round of 2, and how he's still stuck on the data fights. <laughs> well, I was just comparing base critical, and I also have yet to play critical myself, I'm just, you know, yeah. I've seen people say that, you know, proud might be harder just I think because the, you don't get those buffs. Yeah, I think the early game of critical mode is a little harder. But those buffs make the mid to late game easy. Uh, you know who was also surprisingly... Yeah, anything, sorry? Anything that can help speed this up? No. I'm talking about the game. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh. Trying to see anyway, if you're saying, any way we could speed this up. If we Max, all... Oh, uh, yes. Um... Who else was surprisingly hard on uh, Proud? Um, Demix. Roxas. Or, I haven't gone to Roxas yet on that one. Oh, that yeah. Roxas, Roxas actually gave me a pretty bad case of red ass on my first playthrough. Jeez. I think he took me like three or so tries. Though I was yeah, on no. standard, though, my first run. Yeah, on Proud, he's he hurts. Oh. <laughs> I remember Demix and Barbosa also walled me for a bit. I'm proud. Uh, Barbosa didn't give me. Actually, neither Demix nor Barbosa gave me that much trouble. Data Demix sucks, but uh, yeah, Barbosa was actually pretty fine. He kept killing Jack a few times for me, and if you let Jack die, you lose the fight. Yeah. But yeah, no, Roxas is just a one-on-one, -on -one and he hurts. And you don't have yep. a glide nope. for that fight. So you have to, you just have to hope you have quick run levels from Wisdom Form. When he does the, when he does Holy. Yeah. Is there a DM skip for that fight? I don't know. A uh, DM skip? Like, skip that desperation move? Because, no. you know, you can do that for certain fights. No, he does that several times in the fight. On Proud. And there's no skip for any of them. Hmm. Because what what he'll nice. do is that he'll get to the he'll get to that point in health where he can cast it, and then after a certain time, instead of the revenge value hitting, he'll just go invincible. That's not and glide terrible. and quick run to the middle. That's right. Weird. I it's thought I let's remembered. see how you dance, but way longer. And <laughs> there's a bigger <laughs> arena. Let's see how you dance. Let's see how you dance. Why does Zigbar sound like a surfer? <laughs> Maybe that's what he was in his original life. Wasn't he a mercenary? I don't know. He might have, just thinking conversation. He might have moonlighted as a mercenary, but hmm. could have been could have been a surfer in his hobbies. We know he was a certain somebody's apprentice, like, long, long ago, but I'm not going to spoil that. Is this the one where we have to fucking guard six enemies? Yeah, I hope not. Well, it might be. I prayed God I sped that footage up. Oh, quit your damn laughing. <laughs> I wasn't laughing, I was breathing. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, are you talking about the game? Here it is. <laughs> oh, the... Yeah. Oh, okay. Thank God I did speed it up. Yeah. <laughs> but... We get some Major Calamity music as well. Major Calamity music? I don't hear anything. <laughs> well, maybe... 
if you had the audio turned on because you have it muted. Yeah, it is actually Calamity music. Yeah. It is good music. Yeah. I uh, just can't wait to see the thumbnail art for that one. That'll turn out nice, I think. Not happy yeah. about the price. I mean, we saw the thumbnail art for this game, though. Yeah. It's by the same person, just gonna... Well, art's expensive, more. Sunset. Why do you think my, none of my thumbnails are gonna have art, art in them, unless it's for MGR? Or any other ones I decide to pay for. Yeah. Unless I'm like way more financially comfortable, I'm not gonna pay. I'm not gonna commission art just because I don't have that kind of money. Same here. I would love to support artists, like I really would. Like me. Like me. Da -da 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 -da. Hooray! I'm gonna teach you for laughing at. Yeah, these these seem incredibly tedious. Yeah. Thankfully, we only have one left, and then we never have... What the fuck what? is he doing? What? what are you doing, Watcher? <laughs> Mark! Mark! <laughs> Speak to me, Mark! <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, he's got Undertale. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't say anything. Anything else? Dark Siders Eleven just replaced with Undertale footage. Yeah, right. <laughs> <sighs> yeah we will see y'all next part. All right, you stop. No, you're still going.